One of the things I found out, besides just having some great food, is reasons why people are involved with this activity tonight. We have something special. Carol, why don't you introduce yourself, tell everybody what's going on. All right, well, I'm the Director of Health and Human Services. Look a little loud so I can hear you. I'm the Director of Health. That, that works. I think you are. I know you are. <laughs> what else do you do? And Human Services. Yes, the okay. Human Services as well. And tonight's a very special event. Not only are we here on health reasons, you know, for the substance abuse prevention program for Fair Lawn. Okay. And trying to promote that. The activity and all the fundraising event by the Chamber of Commerce is to help support the Human Services Department in the borough Fair Lawn. Oh, really? And that's to help the needy families in town. Okay, that, that we've established. This is something that I wasn't really quite aware of before. This is the Parents Who Host Lose the Most activity. So I can't, even though I'm not a parent, I still, that would still affect me too, right? It's not just it's, parents, it's yes. any adult any doing adult. that kind of a thing. Any adult. And if I did it the wrong way, you might come and visit me? Absolutely, yeah. Is that true? Yeah, that could happen. Definitely. Introduce yourself. I understand that you're very much involved with this. Yeah, all right. My name is uh, uh, Derek Bassing. I'm a lieutenant with the Fair Island Police Department. Are you, are you sure about that? You almost, you almost stumbled on your name. <laughs> and, your involvement. Uh, yes, and I am uh, the Alliance President, Fair Island Drug Alliance uh, President. And basically our group, what we do is we meet monthly and we sponsor uh, drug-free and healthy events. And we try to focus on the younger, younger people, but it's also for parents to get involved and promote um, drug-free events and we is get this money kind of issue, is this kind of issue become a problem by the way this issue has always been a problem it's something that um, is against the law right so if the police respond to your house and you're having those underage people drinking there and you know about it you can be arrested for it and it's a criminal you know, I, I've heard some stories of some unfortunate incidences where things like that exactly happen the awareness that you're bringing do you think the message is getting through to people this is, again, this is what we're trying to do here with this program. So it's an awareness program. We're trying to get people to realize that they have these programs. There's a lot of liability if you have a party in your house. Uh, and it could end up into a tragic event. So we don't, we're trying to avoid that. And you know, that's what we're trying to do here today is promote our program and remind people how serious this is. Why have you been here? Have you had a chance to sell any food? I haven't yet, but I plan well, is Carol on. not letting you walk around? No, she, she's letting me. I I, I've seen her. I've seen you walking around a little bit. And we have some good old new volunteer good. Pat, just say hi to everybody. So I know you're involved, I saw you do some serious work, and I know you believe in this very strongly. I think it's that kind of awareness that the general public, even though they think about knowing what to do, not everybody does it the right way. So the more we're getting involved with in this kind of promotion, the better it is. And people could adopt the sign, what's this all about? Yes, we want parents or anyone with children, teenagers, and anyone over age 10, if they would be nice enough to adopt a sign. We want to get the word out to the public. Okay. So adopting a sign means putting a sign on your lawn for one week, just so that you know we get the information out there. There is a phone number that people can contact. Do you know what it is? More information. Yes, it is my office. Tell, tell everybody what that. I just want to make sure before I ask you what. What is it? Two zero one seven nine four five three two seven. For more information, do call us in the health department. All right, right. Just get in touch with the health department, and they'll be able to reach you on that. Yes. Tip of my hat to you, you as well, and especially you, plus 68, yes. <laughs> because we're doing something great. Enjoy the event. This is going to a great cause, too. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you, Thank Wayne. You. Awesome. Wayne. Keep on walking around. Stay with me, and don't go away.